Warriors, this is being reset right behind your back. Or maybe it's right in front of your face, but you just can't see it because it's being masked by a pandemic. So as we're looking this way, the 1% are going this way, Warriors. My name is Coach JV. I am the top health and mindset coach in the world. What you believe in your heart, you think in your mind will eventually become your words and become your reality. I do a YouTube video every single day just bringing you information. There is the internet of things. You can find all this information all over the internet. I don't believe the narrative. I do the research to connect the dots to create my own paradigm so I can live my own paradise here on earth. No matter what happens in the new quantum financial system, the fourth industrial revolution, they can never take my mind because I'm a warrior in a modern day society and you can be as well. This is just information. I always say don't trust a word I say. Learn the skill of educating yourself. Question everything I'm saying and allow yourself to go down the rabbit hole so you can do the same thing that I'm doing. I teach my warriors that I'm not their leader, I'm not their coach. I'm opening up their awareness to the possibilities for them as a human being. So as the world pushes you into the left hemisphere of the brain, facts, figures, numbers, logic, scarcity, we operate as our warriors in the right hemisphere of the brain. Light, love, positivity, and massive amount of abundance. And warriors, there's something happening massive right now. So make sure you like, subscribe, comment, hit that notification button, hit the like button, let YouTube know we're going to good, doing a good job So I'm sure these type of videos are going to get a lot of reach. So the more that you tell YouTube we're doing a good job, they'll give more people the information. I'm just here to share. Like I said, comment below, share your information. If you have some knowledge and maybe I'm wrong, then post down below. But this feels right for me and it's completely changed my life. All right, Warriors, so let's jump right into it. So today I want to talk about what is happening rapidly and quickly. Now, if you've been watching my videos, you're going to see the narrative and the language change very, 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 very rapidly. So you've heard from the powers to be that Bitcoin's a fraud, correct? You've heard that from Jamie Diamond from Chase and now Chase Bank. Uh, banks the number one cryptocurrency platform, Coinbase. They also open up their own blockchain where cryptocurrencies can run on their blockchain. Bank of America has the most cryptocurrency pa uh, patents. Um, who else do we got there? Wells Fargo invested $5 million in a cryptocurrency platform. Interesting. And they'll decline your debit card sometimes when you order cryptocurrency. Isn't that interesting? Are you starting to see the narrative warriors? They don't want you to see what's happening. They don't want you to know that we're moving to the fourth industrial revolution. They don't want you to know that the great reset is here. Now they put it in plain sight, but you're not watching it. The World Economic Forum, I'm giving you these videos, is putting it in plain sight, but that's not what you're watching because the attention is over here. There's about 7 billion people in the world and about 2,000 people are watching these videos. Think about that, Warriors. Put that in perspective. But over 300 million people are watching the Watt video. So if you were in a, uh, a grocery store line back in the days, and there was a Bible and a tabloid magazine, which one would you read? Be truthful with yourself. We all know we'd pick up the tabloid magazine. I'm showing you information that's not that exciting. But this information could completely change your life. Imagine if someone handed you a golden ticket, the playbook to what the billionaires are doing. A golden ticket. That's what we teach our warriors, what I'm doing in the new quantum financial system. But let's dive right into it. So let's listen to Fed Chair Jerome Powell, who makes our financial decisions for America, talk about the economy as we knew it might be over. Might be? It's completely over. I would agree that um, what this crisis is in the process of doing is it is accelerating a lot of pre-existing uh, technological change. So technological change raises productivity generally, and over long periods of time, those gains tend to be broadly shared. But in the short term, that may or may not be the case. And I, I along with many others, will leave social media out of it, by the way, in terms of adding to <clears throat> productivity. I would, I'm not sure I would say that for social media. But <clears throat> for other kinds of technology, I would say it. And um, in this particular uh, situation, I, I would worry that the changes, we're not going back to the same economy. We're going, we're recovering, but to a different economy. And it'll we're, Let's repeat that. Let's go back. Look what he just said. This is Jerome Powell. Look up who Jerome Powell is. We're recovering, but to a different economy. Let me play that one more time. 
we're, we're not going back to the same economy. We're going, we're recovering, but to a different economy. And it'll be one that is more leveraged to technology. And I worry that that is going to make it even more difficult than it was for, for many workers who, as Andrew just mentioned, you know, the, it's a relatively low paid public facing workers. In I've been saying anybody making 34,000 and below is going to be left behind. All the service workers are going to get crushed, crushed. So if you are in the service industry, you have to wake up, warriors. This is the biggest shift in generational wealth happening right now. You don't have to be rich. You don't have to be wealthy to be on the receiving end of this wars. It's time to wake up. It's time to take control of our lives. It's time to think like the billionaires and act like the billionaires so that you could take care of your family. You don't have to live in scarcity. God created abundance for all of us. It's available for all of us, not the 1% the uh, service sector who are bearing the brunt this is largely minorities and women or, or skewed toward minorities and women and relatively low paid so those people are going to struggle to get back to work in their old jobs or in in many cases in new jobs so i mean i think you'll see more telework you'll see probably the acceleration of of automation um all of that was in the process of happening but you're gonna he keeps saying you'll probably see have you watched any of my other videos? Have you watched what the World Economic Forum, the fourth industrial revolution, not probably, it's coming. And you can invest in this, warriors. You can invest in this for pennies on the dollar right now. That's what they're doing. That's why they don't want you to know. I see much more of it. And I, I guess that for me, the main takeaway from all of this is that um, even after the unemployment rate goes down and the economy is, you know, and there's a vaccine, there's going to be a probably a substantial group of workers who are going to need support as they find their way in the post-pandemic economy because it's going to be different in some fundamental ways. It's going to be different in some fundamental ways. Look at this. Look at, look at the reaction. Look at that. Ah, guys, we got to wake up. We got to wake up. So make sure you go like, subscribe, comment. Thank you to ACs. I'm going to attach. I always attach the videos that I'm using as resources. Please go um, like and subscribe, subscribe to their channel. Okay. Now, Okay, we've been saying Bitcoin's a fraud, right? That's the narrative. Bitcoin's a fraud. What if I told you senators in America are investing in Bitcoin? Senator-elect, uh, you got another first under your belt. This one, uh, very interesting. You're the first senator to own Bitcoin. I'm going to be fully transparent here and say I'm not well-versed in Bitcoin, but I know that there are a couple people who believe, yes, you should be an advocate for this type of currency, and then there are other people who are raising some concerns that this could be a, a front for money laundering or for some sort of tax evasion. Where do you stand? Where Do you hope to bring Bitcoin uh, into the national conversation? I do hope to bring Bitcoin into the national conversation. I'm a former state treasurer, and I invested our state's permanent funds. So I was always looking for a good store of value, and uh, Bitcoin uh, fits that bill. Boom! Shots fired. <laughs> God, this is amazing, Warriors. PayPal. It's on PayPal now. Senators are saying it's a store of value. Bitcoin, cryptocurrencies... It's that's life changing wars. Uh, our own currency inflates. Uh, Bitcoin does not. It's uh, 21 million Bitcoin will be mined, and that's it. It is a finite supply. Uh, so I have confidence that this is going to be an important. So let me let me break that down. What she's saying. Bitcoin has um, um, having every four years. So it becomes more scarce and more scarce, more scarce. Something that's a store of value and becomes more scarce becomes extremely valuable. What she said is our dollar, and I'm gonna show you in this other video, our dollar is inflated. They're literally just printing, 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 printing. All the billionaires are running out of fiat currency, government issued currency to stores of value. You can do the same thing, warriors player in stores of value for a long time to come well we are more well versed now after that answer and uh, so <laughs> we are more well -versed now. Uh, you got right. another so uh, i will share this link down below um all right so now this one i want you guys please go subscribe to the the epic economist i love their videos i'm going to share just part of their video because I, I want you to go to their channel and watch it um but one of our amazing warriors sent this to me and i i watch all their videos and i want to i want you to go subscribe to epic economist they break things down so amazing and so uh, i'm going to do a little bit of narrative on the first half of the video and then go watch it and then i'll share with you my thoughts
to keep updated with the next unfoldings of the economic collapse. The global health crisis has sped up numerous problematic tendencies that were already in course, such as the exponential rise of debt growth, the increasing dependency on the government, and the expansion of central bank interventions into markets in the economy. The increasing dependency on government. The pandemic made you depend on them for your money. Economy. Now, central bankers seem to be ready to set their cards on the table on their greatest power move ever. In collaboration with the IMF, Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell is about to launch central bank digital currencies. Recently, the International Monetary Fund has called out for a new... So what that means is they're going to launch a digital CBDC. Is a, uh, um, uh, basically a cryptocurrency. It's a digital dollar for us. It will run on a blockchain. Bretton Woods movement in an effort to address the trillions of dollars in global economic output that were lost in the wake of the health crisis. After World War II, the original Bretton Woods Agreement determined the U.S. dollar as the reserve currency in a new world monetary order. Back then, the dollar had to be tied to the price of gold, and foreign investments and their central banks still had the alternative to purchase their dollar reserves in gold until the end of the 60s and the early 70s. However, in 1971, President Richard Nixon closed the gold window, leading to a new era of global monetary order that solely relied upon the full faith and credit of the United States. Okay, so let me break that down for you guys. Okay, the Bretton Woods standard was, I think, 1943. So that's when gold backed the dollar, right? Okay, so you have the Federal Reserve that prints the money. So in 19, we want to go back to a Bretton Woods standard. Judy Shelton, all you can watch all my videos in a cryptocurrency type way. That's what she said. She got ushered into the feds, okay? She wants to do a Bretton Woods type standard, a, a gold backed currency in a cryptocurrency type of way. President Nixon detached us from the gold standard in 1971. That just gave the feds the ability to print, 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 print. So we became a debt society. So the only way America can survive is if there's a bunch of debt in the economy. If there's more debt, there's more jobs. More debt, more jobs. Now we're in a pandemic, right? And it's all by design. I'm not saying it's conspiracy, but it's all by design. They're going to lock us down, make us rely on the government, keep printing money into infinity. They're going to lower interest rates super low, so it'll stimulate you to go into the economy and get, get a credit, right? You go buy houses, and their inflation's going to go up, so your dollar's going to be worth less. So when you get your next stimulus check, they're going to put it on a digital dollar, and then we are going to move to the new quantum financial system. The new, if you, December 21st, if you watch my other video, we're moving from um, basically industrial to technical, and in the, the cosmos too as well, we're moving from Capricorn to Aquarius, from Earth to to air. This is happening at a spiritual level as well, Warriors. This is like I'm handing you a golden ticket right now. A golden ticket. Years later, a massive spike in inflation was recorded, which prompted the Federal Reserve to elevate interest rates to defend its wilting Federal Reserve note and manage the rising prices. At the present day, the Fed has assumed for itself powers to create unprecedented policies for a new monetary system. But this time around, they're not planning a return to sound money. Instead, their new plan includes more debt, more inflation, and basically selecting who are going to be the winners and losers in the economy. In the blink of an eye, the Fed got rid of its regulatory dual mandate of full employment and steady prices, and now the central bank has given itself unrestricted powers to inject stimulus and bail out cash whenever it's convenient, including junk bond exchange traded funds. Rather than seeking the balance and stabilization of prices, the Fed has been openly engaging in an inflation raising campaign aiming to generate annual price level increases above 2%. Okay, do you remember if you watch my other videos, you watched the Jerome Powell address to the nation, and he said that they are moving to a flexible inflation rate. They literally gave themselves the power just to print money into infinity, and they gave us a flexible inflation rate. That is not good. They said they will, as long as they hit a 2% inflation rate within a reasonable amount of time, 
So you could see a 3%, 4% inflation rate now as long as they recorrect in the future. They're not going to recorrect in the future. We're switching to the new quantum financial system orders. I'm going to stop there. I'd highly recommend. I'll put this link down in there. I'd highly recommend you go watch these videos. Now, Warriors, I want to really get to your heart right now. What I'm sharing with you is a golden egg. There's the biggest shift in generational wealth happening right now in history. We're moving from the new industrial age, the old industrial age, to the fourth industrial revolution. We are moving from earth to air. We can't stop this freight train warriors, but we sure as hell can get on it. You sure as hell can become the captain of your own ship. And warriors, you can invest in the new quantum financial system. You can become the new generational wealth. And what my dream is, is freedom for every single warrior around me. It's time to activate warriors. Life as you know it will never be the same. This is not a scare tactic. These are facts. As you look at the narrative and you get pissed about left or right, Democrat, Republican, as you fight over your religions, you do all this stuff, there's a whole other narrative happening while you're asleep, warriors. And I'm here to wake you up. It's mind, body, immunity, and generational wealth. As we move into the new fourth industrial revolution, you have to protect your mind, warriors. And I have created a program and we got 109 warriors at a global level, nine different countries. We have a program where we take you through an 18 week mindset program. You get access to my general, you can, I'm not a financial advisor, none of it's financial. You get to look over my shoulder as I invest in the quantum financial system. You get access to our warrior group, Zoom calls, connection, community. You work out live with me and Kevin anytime on a daily basis. We wrap our arms around you and we help you move into this new quantum financial system, also the fourth industrial revolution. So if you're ready to activate warriors, if you're an activator and you're ready, you can click the link down below and you can join the group right now. You can start tomorrow. If you want to get to know and like and trust us, join the free global group. The global, global Facebook group. We go live every single day, Warriors. I've been bringing information for three years. This isn't about money. This is about helping people. 850 podcasts, close to 800 YouTube videos, close to almost 6,000 social media posts. This is not about me, Warriors. It's about helping as many people realize the power they have inside. So if you're ready to activate, click the link down below and let's go. Warriors, rise. Let's go.